My name is Andrew Patterson. I'm a Regents Professor with the University of Georgia, and I lead the Feed the Future Laboratory for Climate Resilient Sorghum. Uh, sorghum is a, a crop that's uh, maybe less well known to, to folks in the U.S. than, than in other countries. Uh, it's often known as the camel of cereals because it's especially tolerant uh, of conditions where it has very little water, of, of uh, drought. Uh, it's able to produce crops under drought, uh, under much more severe drought than, uh, than many other uh, crops are able to tolerate and is, is often known as the most drought resilient of the major grain crops. Our two focal areas have each yielded early successes with rich pipelines of additional material promising further advances. Toward improving drought resilience, we've built on work conducted under the now ended CGIAR Generation Challenge Program, leading to the release of one high yielding drought resilient line, Sambola, to farmers in Mali. Release of a sister line named Samboni is in progress and we are evaluating many new populations in Mali and Ethiopia that promise additional releases. Further, we identified a genotype derived from a wild sorghum relative that increased yield of hybrids by an average of 22% over the higher yielding parent that can be deployed promptly. Toward development of sorghums that can produce multiple crops from single plantings, we have made a major breakthrough in the ability to cross elite sorghums and perennial relatives to combine their respective merits. Our work on improving the drought resilience of sorghum, uh, together with the development of cultivars that are able to produce multiple crops from single plantings, uh, promises to be an important element uh, in feeding the future in a more sustainable manner.